Namaste. I'm Atilia, remember? <laughs> we are now on our sixth episode already and I have here with me Aza who will be uh, helping me. And today what we're going to do is we're going to do this pose which is called the chair pose. The reason why I said the chair pose is because it hurts a lot when you do it. So let's just pretend that we're going to sit on a chair like a lady. Sit on a chair and make sure this is 90 degrees. You're not like that. This is arching your back, which is not good. You're not scrunching your back. You're just straight like that. Okay? Let me just... What are you doing there? This is actually arching your back. You are arching your back. Okay, this is right. This is straightening your back. And this has got to go lower because you want to go 90. Strong legs. Grip. Good. Okay, now that we're ready, bring both your hands up. Look up. Breathe. Again, go into the chair pose again. Lift your hands up. Bring it close to your chest, like prayer position. Into a prayer position. And turn to your right. Hook your elbow to your right knee and look up. See what Eza is doing here? She's bringing her left hand to the floor and her right up. So she's giving it a stretch as well. Good. Let's move to the other side. Hook your right elbow, right hand to the floor. Bring your left one up. Look up. And breathe. And smile. All right. Okay, now we're going to go down to the floor. Go down to the floor. Bend your knees. Both hands. Your palms are facing to the front. Okay. Now, Bring your toes to the floor, like that, like a ballerina. And once you think you're stable, straighten your legs up. Mm -hmm. We're working your core now. Now, bring both your hands up. Lift. Yep. And smile. Remember the breathing I taught you? Do that. Slow, jai breaths. You're going to be doing this for 20 breaths. But we are going to cheat and do five. One. Two. Three. Stay there, you're strong. Four. Last one, five. Nice. Just grab a towel. And place it behind your neck like this so you won't hurt your neck. Just go down to the floor. Legs are still in the same position. Grab your towels, lift your neck, and let's do some crunches. Let's do Kaliza. One, two, go. One, two, three, four, five, six. You can do it. Seven, eight. Last one. No, I lied. <laughs> Nine. Last one. Now ten. All right. That's good. Now, bring both your hands, put them under your butt. Straighten your legs. We're going to do 50 leg lifts. Are you ready? Let's do it. One, two, not all the way down to the floor. Three, four, five. Contract your core. Okay, I want you to stop. <laughs> okay, bring it, like I said just now, you have to bring it, both your hands under your butt. Okay. Keep your legs straight, as straight as you can. Nice. And when you lift, use a little bit of momentum so you can also work on your lower abs. There you go. Alrighty. So, that's it for today. What we did just now, we did the chair pose, we did the boat pose, we did the leg lifts and we also did some crunches. So what we did just now was we worked on our butt and we worked on our core. We'll see you on the next episode. Namaste.